In the previous lesson, we went through on how to install a WordPress theme. Now that you have set up what your WordPress looks like in this lesson, we will be going through on how to plan for your website. Let's start off by looking at the keywords and competitor research. When creating your website, it is a good practice to look at your direct competitors and see how they have designed their website. This includes the keywords they may have used throughout their website and the different pages of their websites. You can make use of tools like Ahrefs and SEMrush to do your keywords research. To simplify the process, you can also consider using Google suggestions to look for suitable keywords. So, what you need to do next is to create a sitemap of the different pages of your competitor website and include their URLs. For each page, you will also want to consider what keywords they are ranking on the page itself. At the same time, you can utilize these same keywords within your websites to optimize it and potentially push your competitors down the search engine results. Next, you need to create a sitemap of your own. A sitemap is a blueprint of your website that helps search engines to find, crawl, and index all your website's content. The sitemaps also tell search engines which pages of your website are most important. This ties in with the keywords research you have earlier conducted. In a sitemap, you need to list out all the different sections and pages of your websites and map it out. For each pages, you will also need to think of the URL. In the URL, besides your domain name, there will always be a path. This usually contains the focus keywords of the page. Let's stop here for a while and continue on our next lesson on where we will be going through more about landing pages.